after the FIFA World Cup in Qatar, his encouragement for the Atlas Lion, his admiration for the Moroccan public, and the atmosphere he lived in with the Moroccan fans in the World Cup, young British YouTuber Topden has arrived in Morocco for the 2022 Club World Cup. What will happen to be his wish for 2023? The young British YouTuber fell in love with everything about Morocco during the FIFA 2022 World Cup, where they shocked everyone in the world of football. Defeating big countries and reaching the World Cup semi finals as the first African countries to reach the semis. Before we go fully into that video, I need you to hit the subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, share to your friends, comment below. Thanks. This is the story of how an Englishman became a Moroccan and it all began in Qatar when I went out there to support England and try to attend all the matches of the World Cup. But this beautiful story I returned with I never thought would happen. It all began when I attended Morocco versus Croatia where they belted out the national anthem. They sang it so loud I realised how much this really meant to the fans. I shared it online and my content was blowing up. The love I was receiving in the comments was insane. People told me to stand with them for the next game so I did against Canada. They won the game to qualify for the final 16. They passed I learned the chance. It was a special experience. Five days later, last 16, they're playing Spain. This time I thought, surely they're not going to win. And after 120 minutes, it was still nil-nil. Penalties time, and it all came down to Hakimi. <laughs> The emotion on display almost made me cry. Still to this day, I think that's one of the best videos on my channel. The Moroccans just loved it. The next step, Ronaldo's Portugal. They've just put six past Switzerland. Not a chance. That's what I thought until Ennisiri leapt like a salmon to give them the lead and held it on all the way. <laughs> My video, over 1 million views for that game. People were translating into Arabic, reposting on TikTok, Instagram. I went everywhere. And now it was semi-finals time. France, World Cup winners, rank number one, reality struck, a tuna loss with wasted chances. But even through a loss, their fans were coming up to me, saying thank you, explaining how I'm one of them, offering me gifts, everything. So during the third place playoff, I recorded a video saying my wish for 2023 is to visit Morocco. Morocco fans, I will see you when I travel to your country. And now now that the FIFA Club World Cup tournament is in that country, I can't waste this opportunity. It's finally happening. 1st of February, it's past midnight, I can't sleep. I've got my Morocco scarf on. Tomorrow, I'm traveling back to the country I fell in love with at the World Cup. Ooh. 